I would say one of my favorite things about camp is the silence. But then right after that, I like to see that silence get filled up. I love the sound of the kids uh, running through camp and uh, just ripping and roaring. Cabin two, give me a woo! Woo! When I say red, you say hot. Red. Hot. Red. Hot. Well, I think what's helpful here is uh, a lot of uh, the distractions of home, the kids, they, they come together to form a, a different kind of family and to participate in a different type of community. They're the first ones to jump out the bus. They're like waving their arms out the buses, they're smiling, they're super excited and they have questions right off the bat. I mean, they're asking about what clubs they can join, can we go do swimming today? Can we go climb the rock wall today? So they definitely just can't wait to jump right in and get started. I grew up going to camp and then I worked at camp. I met my husband at camp, so I feel like my whole life is revolved around camp at some point. It changed my life, it, it opened the world to me. It just really expanded not only who I can be, but what the Salvation Army is. Everything that we do here is, is all about fostering the opportunity for our campus to uh, interact with God. My favorite part about camp coming to camp is Jesus Theater. I learned that you have a choice to be with Jesus or choose the wrong way. We put on a play called Jesus Theater, and it's practically the main story of God, his creations, and then the story of Jesus. During the end, Captain Sienna always gives this prayer, and she asks, is there anyone here who hasn't accepted God into their life? So of course, some kids will raise their hands, and I love that part because that means that we see that God's kingdom is going to grow today. I think a big thing is the um, spiritual message as well. I've always been a Christian, always gone to church, but I just feel like being here has really made me feel much more like at one with things and I'm just gonna take that back and try and spread it to other people and you know because I've seen like how rewarding it's been for the children here so I know how I can make it rewarding for the kids at home. They get to come and be here for a week and just enjoy being a kid. It's totally different out here. It's a different environment. Everything is, is focused on them, is tailored for them, centered for them to grow and enjoy just being a kid. And I don't feel like kids get to do that all the time anymore. All year I've been waiting to come back to camp. And like three weeks before, I was already set and packed, just waiting, sitting there waiting. And nature, I love nature. It's a good place to let your kids hang out over the summer. They have gold cards, basketball, soccer, football. My favorite thing about camp is like the counselors and you get to do a lot of stuff with them. My favorite thing about camp, I really like the rock wall, like archery, and uh, gaga ball. I like all the like staff and everybody. Our staff, a lot of them, this is their very first job, so they learn a lot of different skills. You know what a work schedule is like, how to you know be committed, integrity, all those things. We bring in international staff from all over the the world, really, and so they get to experience America and have this great experience here. So that's life changing for them. This year, uh, we have about 18 staff members uh, from out of the country. So we're talking Scotland, Ireland, New Zealand, England, just to name a few places. I think it's great for the kids to get an idea of the diversity uh, that the world has to offer, uh, as well as the uh, different cultural expressions and experiences. Um, I think the staff is the biggest thing, and the captains, John and Sienna as well, because um, they just make you feel so welcome. It's home, and I just feel so content. It has been such a great experience for me, like in my social life, in my professional life as well as a teacher. You know, the things I've learned here, I'll definitely bring with me, you know, in my career as a teacher. So it's such a great experience. I have loved it. So it's nice for them to come, and it's really different from being at home, you know, where maybe there's like a lot of cities and buildings. It's really, really nice to see them enjoy themselves and relax a little bit out in the countryside. It's so lovely to see. I love it. It's nice to give them like the little escape into a different type of area, different scenery. Usually they come in all shy and then you see them break out of their shell. They'll come in with like no friends and by the end of the week they're all best buds. It's a beautiful place here. I wouldn't change that for anything. Seeing, seeing the scenery here, the kids, the staff, 
it's, it's amazing. They're busy all day long, but we tire them out. They're, they're running from the moment they get up to the very time they go to sleep. Our nature center is really awesome. We have all sorts of small animals and they can sit in the pen with them. They hold the chickens, they, they get the eggs out of the coop, they hold rabbits. Um, we had ducks hatched this summer and they were able to see the ducks hatching. It's so fun and yet they're learning valuable lessons while they're doing it, so it's really cool. Every single camper you love swimming. They all love swimming. I love doing swimming. I like swimming, playing in the sand. I like to swim because it usually gets really hot. At the waterfront, you get to just go swimming and there's things that you could jump in. It's just a lot of fun swimming with your friends. Swimming time can't be long enough for them. If you see them from being afraid to even put their foot in the water to actually learning the backstroke by the end of the week, that's pretty cool. And the most rewarding thing for me is when they start off in the beginners and we teach them how to swim a little bit, and we get in the water with them, we play with floats and things like that. Giving them a blue band at the end of it, which means they can then go into the deeper section of the water and be able to swim, they just love it. And they're just so grateful to be in the water, especially on like nice hot days like this. It's our job, my job, and the council's job that are there for the kids to uh, encourage them, to give them good words. How they start out scared and then finally they start to get up, get up, and they actually have fun with it. And then when they come down, they're like, can I go again? Can I go again? I love that part of my job. I think going to camp gives them this experience where they can interact with other people and you know, that's going to prepare them for the real world when they do eventually have to go to like high school or even middle school. I think the kids can appreciate being in the, in the outdoors and, and just kind of having that freedom to, to run and, and just be kids for a week. I think it's great. There's a sense of excitement and there's a little bit of the unknown as well. And I kind of resonate with them. I was in the city. You know, but, but I was brought out to the country over the years that, you know, developed this awesome appreciation for it. We feel like we have a really quality program, really strong program, and, and anybody can come. We don't consider income at all. So when they come, they're, it's all an even playing field. And when they see that it's all for them, then they really start to open up, and that's really cool. We're here for the kids. It's just an awesome place to be, to connect with God, to connect with yourself and learn something else about yourself that maybe you didn't know about. Uh, camp is a great place to be. Connery is what? Red Hot! Connery is what?